Hello everyone and welcome to Interesta, an interesting little game we got here. Now I made this as part of the Steam Demo Festival, even though it's kind of out of season and I don't usually do that, but this game is still a demo because the full game isn't out yet and basically I had nowhere else to put it. And this game seemed pretty interesting so I did really want to play it. The demo itself is only like 10 minutes long, less than that seeing as the first time I played it myself. I kind of went around and grabbed everything that I could, which is something I'm not going to do, by the way, because I was just wasting my own time. So this game isn't, like, overly special. Like, it isn't doing things, right, that haven't been done before. But I would like to put it on everyone's radar, because it does seem like a fun little game. Also, I noticed that uh, the door has this really smooth opening and closing animation, but when you spam it, it doesn't know what to do. I found that pretty funny. So basically, story, right? We crash landed on this planet and we have to get off of it. There is a rocket station somewhere near and we have to go there. For right now, we have to survive and grab some fruit and water droplets, I guess. Goo droplets. So it is kind of a survival game, but it does seem like it is mainly going to focus on a more linear story based crafting progression to go from planet to planet. If you do care about some of the story, even though currently there really isn't a lot, or at least not that they really tell you, because the game is voice acted, which is pretty sweet as well. Uh, you should honestly just play the demo yourself. Like I said, it only takes like 10 minutes, and I already went the wrong direction. I have to go to this cave over here. Man, yeah, this little prologue, it's mainly just go gather some of the basic resources and leave the planet, right? It's just a tutorial. You know, here I am collecting basically all the resources, and I was, and I said I wasn't gonna do that. I estimate the rocks to be too heavy to move using your weakened body. You know, I found that kind of funny. They call it your weakened body, and that's why you can't move these rocks. In all honesty, I don't think with my fucking regular strength I'd be able to move these goddamn rocks. Like, how fucking superhuman is this man? We have this terminal has. Crafting recipes in the inbox. Very convenient. And now we need to get a bunch of stuff. So we need to let... I actually need a lot more than I originally thought I would need. And now honestly, that's probably because last time I played this, I just kind of went around and grabbed as much of everything as I could. I do like how everything basically glows and just kind of stands out. It does look kind of odd though, because everything looks different from what you expect. Like, titanium usually is more of a whitish color. And same with iron, it's more of like a grayish color. Now, I'm pretty sure iron does have green in it, realistically seen. I'm pretty sure. But it does look quite odd. Also, this just looks like crystals to me, to be fair. I don't think that once this game comes out, I am one of those people that are just hoarding all the supplies that I can find. I see there was also something interesting here. So you see an entire crafting recipe here, and it's basically just a crafting tree. And you could just create straight from here. I do wish this was set to 1 instead of 0. And I also wish you could just kind of craft it from here itself, right? I think that'd be way better. So when you free of these, I also wish the UI was be, would be a little bit bit bigger because I can read this text man like it's so hard to read and we just drill the rocks away this is gonna take a little while because it does have a heat meter which honestly I find usually better than a durability bar although this kind of has both evils because it does have a battery as well also I would have expected to be able to do something with these large ones these large eggs but you can't do anything with those but anyway there's a huge building over there so let's head that way so here's uh, kind of something weird, like these mushrooms, you can jump on these and it's, this is kind of like a platforming area. I don't know why, I couldn't, I can't really replicate it right now for some odd reason. I had issues getting on this mushroom and it felt like I was sliding off of them. But I don't even know how I did it because I can't seem to reproduce that. So maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe I was fucking drunk while playing it last time, who knows. We're basically on the mushroom planet, and there's a bunch of other planets as well. 
However, uh, oh, there's this ice planet. Where did it go? I'm not sure if I just saw this right. But basically, last time I played this, I didn't see this screen. I thought I couldn't click on it. So what do I need? Can I create this or am I literally just stuck here now? So it needs a cockpit. How do I craft things from here though? Let's see if we can craft that. So there's a fuel tank, which we can place. Oh, uh, fuel tank seems to go have to go over there. This looks like the thing that goes on top. It says it's not attached to anything, and we'll figure that out later, right? This looks like the thing at the bottom. And we don't seem to have any wings? I don't know. Let's fucking do it. Can't fly without a cockpit. There isn't really any thing here that shows me how to make that. Is there anything else in here? That would be nice to see if uh, we could like craft something. See if we can craft the thing that we needed pretty much. Yeah, let's head back to that place with the crafting station. Maybe we can do something there. Okay, so we didn't get any new things, right? No. So let's see. More plating. Would that just be, you know, something we would need eventually? Or to make things. So let's get a couple mechanical parts and a comfortable plating. Maybe we can just, you know, make things. Okay, let's see. Mechanical parts... It says that we can make four maximum, so let's do that. And five of the plating. Okay, good. So we have everything now. At least everything mechanically that we can make. I will assume now that there, uh, we cannot craft the rocket just yet. Seeing as this is a demo. Well, we can't particularly craft anything else now. So that's not really a, uh, a good thing. So yeah, we kind of did waste our time collecting all those resources again. Unless there's another planet, but I don't think so. But yeah, that was uh, everything that Interesta has for now. At least I think so, because I can't seem to figure out how to make other rocket parts. So I assume you cannot do that yet. I don't see any work table around here, at least not that it's marked. And they seem to like mark things with points of interest. So this game I think could be pretty interesting. As the quantum potential seems to be more focused around a story rather than, you know, pure survival, building bases, everything like that. It's just kind of go from planet to planet. That's at least what it looks like currently. And, you know, it is something different. So we'll see how that turns out. If you guys want to see a proper Let's Play when this game comes out, let me know in the comments down below. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everyone.